Hey everyone, welcome back to Error Genie. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the failed to initialize PlayStation PC SDK error. If you're running into this issue, don't worry. I've got a few simple solutions that can help get you back to gaming quickly. Let's dive right into it. Solution 1. The first method is to run the PSPC SDK runtime installer. Head over to the directory where your PlayStation PC SDK is installed. Look for the runtime installer file. Run the installer and follow the prompts to install or repair the SDK runtime. This should help resolve any issues related to the SDK failing to initialize. Solution 2. Another possible fix is to unlink your Steam and PlayStation Network PSN accounts. Open your Steam app and go to Settings. Navigate to the Linked Accounts section. Find your PSN account and click Unlink. After unlinking, restart Steam and try launching your game again. Relink your accounts after testing to see if the issue persists. Solution 3. If the issue continues, try deleting the Sony Interactive Entertainment Inc. folder. Open File Explorer and go to the App Data folder, usually located at C colon users your username app data. Navigate to Local or Roaming, then find the folder named Sony Interactive Entertainment Inc. Delete this folder entirely, restart your computer and relaunch the game. This clears any corrupted files that may be causing the error. That's it. These three solutions should help you fix the failed to initialize PlayStation PC SDK error. If you found this video helpful, be sure to hit like and subscribe for more gaming fixes and tech tutorials. Let us know in the comments if any of these solutions worked for you. Happy gaming, and I'll catch you in the next 